All right, guys, we're here with an online storage unit, and this is a pretty nice unit here. Uh, it is in Northern California, and we'll go ahead and start with this first picture here. And I've already looked at this, so I can point out a few things to you. So we've got comic books, comic books, comic books, and comic books. An R2-D2. Over here we have a large Spider-Man Pez dispenser. Um, I don't think they actually had giant candy for it. I think it was just a, just a collectible piece. We've got this big uh, tank looking thing. I'm not quite sure what this is from. But if I had to guess I'd say this toy is from the 80s. Uh, as most of the stuff in here seems to be from the 80s. Uh, we've got a, looks like a fold-up camping chair, nothing special there. But honestly, that's probably the only thing I've seen in here that wasn't something special. Down here in the corner, you can see that there is a Nerf gun. That's like the barrel from it, uh, which you'll see in another picture. This tub here, I think this tub is full of toys most likely older toys again i would say probably 80s or 90s um this here is a little stomp pad for like a rocket launcher at least that's what i it looks like to me anyway so let's move up let's go to the uh let's see we'll go up to the top right here in this box here this green that is a godzilla action figure uh, I'm not sure what this is here. I might be able to see that in another picture. I don't know. Uh, this up here. See it says G.I. Joe. Got another tub here. Possibly full of toys. Let's get a little zoom in. Well, we're already zoomed in all the way. Um, it looks like it's in the box. Brand new in the box. Same here. Another in the box item. Uh, you can see that says Opoly. That's an old Monopoly game. Nothing too crazy. Uh, Alright, let's get into some better pictures here. Alright, as we pointed out before, this is the box that was on the ground. The comic books. Um, it looks like it's the Combiner Wars. Transformers Combiner Wars. Uh, not too crazy. I, I think they were showing around like $15.00. But if those are all that and they're all around 15, it adds up fast. Uh, again, here's the R2-D2. Um, you can see the comic book in there. And there's the ones that we just saw. More comic books, guys. We got. Let's start at the bottom. We've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 boxes right here. Plus the other three we had seen. That's 11 boxes of comics. Um, and who knows what's in those. Especially with how many old things. old Older toys this guy has. Alright, so that thing that we couldn't see before. That was a Crimson Guard. Uh, that is one of the few things I haven't looked up in here. I don't know how to look this up exactly, because I'm sure this is an older Godzilla. Um, right here, in this case, looks like a little Transformer guy. Uh, looks like there's probably another one there. But there's really not a whole lot that we get from this image. Can we see what... Can't tell what any of this says. Happy birthday is all I see. Um, not exactly sure what any of that is. Next, look at this. Disney Tron Sark action figure. Uh, I did look this one up, and I believe it was around 40. Uh, not sure what this is. Again, it's just an older toy. These up here, I don't know what these two are. 
I don't know if they're the same as this one over here. This one here I was able to find. It's a was it VF dash one A I think. Uh, Valkyrie. I don't know if it was a model or what. I did look it up, uh, and it is online for about two hundred and fifty dollars. Uh, and obviously it's got its box because it's in the box. Or it may just be the box. But I wouldn't think so. Anyway, there's that uh, giant Pez dispenser there. We've got a truck upside down. Don't know if that's really anything old or not. Uh, here is the Nerf down here. And here's that stomp pump I was talking about. That I thought was for like a rocket launcher. Who knows, it might be for something nerf i guess not sure uh i cannot tell what this is this looks like a tub full of toys uh this is like the comic books but it almost looks like actual books in there as well maybe graphic novels possibly and we do have a lot of big boxes this box here looks like it's got a bunch of toys in it see one sticking out there let's hop to the next picture so we got the star wars return of the jedi ewok village i did look this up um i i don't remember exactly i want to say it was like 250 dollars i think it was somewhere between 250 and 400 with if you had the box or not this box is does look a little uh wore down though it's pretty beat up but it is there there's that monopoly board up there other than that there's not too much here i don't know what this black thing is here but you can see it uh reflects maybe it's a mirror inside the box i, I don't know but it reflects just like a mirror because you can see another storage unit outside. Anyway, moving on. We've got a Star Wars. This is a metal, uh, die-cast metal TIE Fighter. Uh, new in the package. I looked it up. I think it was around $15. Um, looks like you got another Star Wars package back here. Something new. You got this Batman, and then it looks like something new in a package here. This is new in a package. You got a Nerf gun. You got a Boba Fett ship here. I believe this Boba Fett ship was around 200 Uh As it is, without the box, it was around 200 online. I uh, don't know what this is called in order to look it up. So I was not able to look this up. But if it's anything like the others, I could imagine it's probably a few hundred dollars. Uh, you got something in a Star Wars package here and here. And then you have some part of a toy here. These back here, I cannot tell what they actually are. If they're books, comic books, if they're something else, I really don't know. Um, yeah, and then you can see down here through this tub, you can see it looks like maybe more books or comic books. Come on, let's zoom out. Um, all right, next picture. So this here looks like something, it looks like a brand new toy. I don't know what it is though. It does not look familiar to me. Like a dragon, guy riding a dragon. Don't, don't know. Let's look up here. I can't tell what any of this is here. Here's the G.I. Joe box. It's the Headquarters Command Center. And if it's in there, uh... I think with the box it was like two to four hundred dollars with box. Um, 
this one up here, a little bit harder to see, or to read it anyway, it says Death Star Space Station. This one I looked up, and with the box, it was, I'd seen a few at 500 and a couple at 700. And that's the last picture there. I cannot tell what this one is here, though. Not able to look that up because I don't know what it is. And this is a 10 by 10 storage unit. What's this? We got something down here. Oh, that's that. Uh, we'd seen that in another picture. Looks like a maybe a transformer in a box. I think that was in like the first picture, maybe. Let's go back to the first one. Yeah, there it is. That's as far as I can go in. Um, this looks like this looks like an X-wing, Star Wars X-wing. I did not look that up. But uh, yeah, this is a killer unit for whoever gets it. I would love to get it, but uh, it's currently around, I think, last bid I saw on it was 5470 and it's still got three days to go. But uh, yeah, thought I'd share that with you guys, because this is a great one. All right. See you guys next time.